Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So I don't know about you, but I'm always looking for a good, juicy new show to tune into. Yeah. And in today's video, I'm showing you two looks that I was inspired to create based on the new show, Our Kind of People. Now, if the title Our Kind of People sounds familiar, it's because the show is based on the critically acclaimed book by Lawrence Otis Graham, Our Kind of People. And actually, I was recommended this book when I first started researching black fraternities and sororities before I became a Delta. And so I was super geeked to see that they actually made a show based on the book. And like many of us, we don't actually know much about the black elite, especially those that got started right after slavery. The book even talks about the first black millionaires in the late 1800s. So the series is actually based off of the lineage of those families. In the aspirational town of Oak Bluffs, based in Martha's Vineyard, this family, the DuPonts and the Franklins and more, have been taking residence there for the last 50 years. And someone new walks into their community and shakes things up. This show really plays on the black and the bougie, the righteousness and the ratchet. Think Empire meets Revenge. Also, as someone who loves everything hair, this show gives me so much life. So in this video, I'm actually going to take you through two looks based on two of the main characters, Angela Vaughn and Leah DuPont. Now this first look is based off of Angela Vaughn. She is the naturalista of the show. She wears incredible natural hairstyles that are just bomb. So this is more of how I refresh my curls. And this style for me is actually super simple. I'm just adding a bit of water and some mousse to revive my curls. Now a trick naturalistas fall into sometimes is not taking as much time to refresh your hair as you did when you first styled your hair. And for me, I, I can't do that, okay? I have to go ahead and take my time, go section by section, rehydrating my curls, and really resetting my curls so that they look brand new, even though they've been worn out for a few days. I am gonna go ahead and diffuse my hair off camera and boom, that's as easy as it gets. And that's one thing I love about our natural hair is that it doesn't take a lot. To just embrace our natural texture is always gonna be a look. Now the next look is inspired by Leah DuPont. And as you can tell, Leah DuPont's hair is slayed, okay? It is pressed to the nines. And so to really nail this look, I actually grabbed a wig and curled it before hopping on camera. Now I am no wig expert at all, but sometimes it's just easier to put a wig on, especially if you can curl it and do the hard work like the day before or a few hours before you really need to like get up and go. And especially with a wig that can also protect your hair as you switch up your styles. This wig was super easy to put on. I just used some spray to set my lace and then while my headband is setting, I'm gonna go ahead and take my curls down and brush them out to give us that retro glam look. And to make this wig look even more real, I'm adding a little bit of a matte bronzer to my forehead to blend in the wig. And the last step is just to brush out the curls and we are done. As you can see, both of these looks are giving the definition of black beauty. We have the ability to be so versatile with the way we wear our hair, how we dress, how we move through the world. And this show really explores all the different types of identities that can exist in blackness. Now, definitely I wanna know what y'all think about this show when it debuts. I will be watching. I'll be waiting to hear your reviews. Keep up with me on social media so we can chat about it. Definitely stay tuned every Tuesday, starting on September 21st, to our kind of people.